cümlesin. Always good to talk, my friend. Mind flip clever. Maybe or maybe he made an offer. I met the first chestnut, the second, even a stroke. You sense uncertainty in Will's voice. He questions his father's explanation. At the bank, but it could you what though? I couldn't say. I couldn't say. My father was to exert these murders aren't random acts. Someone powerful is guy. I never quite realized how burdened I was until I met you. The threat of the Shadow Curse, the politics of the Grove. I was forgetting who I was. But you lifted the fog. Thank you. <laughs> You're too modest. I wager you don't even know how extraordinary you truly are. But I do. I have lived a very long time. I have taken many lovers. My heart does not stir lightly. But it does now. I want more than to fight at your side, or sit around the campfire with you. I want to lay with you under the stars and feel your skin against mine. I think you feel the same way. Once the power of the Shadow Curse was broken, the connection was undeniable. We both felt it. But tell me I'm wrong, and the matter can rest. I do not wish to sour our friendship, but I have to know if it can be something more. with Gale, body and soul. His scent lingers on your skin. If there is to be anything between us, it must be with his consent. And perhaps someday, his participation. Some treat their relationships like a walled garden, tidy, tamed, cut off from the world. That is their right, but it is not for me. I do as nature does, and let my heart run wild. Desire flourishes wherever it finds purchase. It has its place, but it is not for me. The wolf mates for life, but the bear roams free and partners as its instinct dictates. I need to stay true to my nature, and you to yours. Perhaps you are like me, or perhaps not. Take your time. I'll be waiting. My time is yours. What do you need? What, like a child? <laughs> I'm not sure I consider myself father material. Plus, our current lifestyle isn't exactly what I'd call settled. Share? You're not a loaf of bread to be divvied up at supper time. I thought what we had meant something to you. Call me 
selfish or old-fashioned, but I cannot agree to that. Either we dedicate ourselves to one another, or this ends here. Very well. Let's... Let's not speak of this again. Given my condition, I'm not sure it's wise for me to invite undue stress upon myself. It has its place, but it is not for me. The wolf mates for love. I need to stay true to my nature, and you to yours. I understand. Still, I could not have forgiven myself had I not taken the plunge. Better to have tried and failed. Hello, my dear. I wasn't expecting it. Anything I can do for you, consider it most enthusiastically done. There's nothing that would give me greater pleasure. More excited than I've been in months. I can't tell you how curious I am to learn more about the crown controlling that elder brain. Believe me when I say how important this could be for me, for both of us. Potentially life-saving, so long as we can learn how it could be taken and used. No matter. After all, a bond like ours hardly needs words to express it. What else is troubling you? <laughs> 